Why don't I know you? I'm new. I just moved here from Africa. What? I used to be homeschooled. Wait, what? My mom taught me at home. No, no, I know what homeschool is. I'm not retarded. So you've actually never been to a real school before? Shut up. Shut up! I didn't say anything. Homeschooled. That's really interesting. Thanks. But you're, like, really pretty. Thank you. So you agree? What? You think you're really pretty? Oh, I don't know. Oh, my God, I love your bracelet. Where did you get it? Oh, my mom made it for me. It's adorable. Oh, it's so fetch. What is fetch? Oh, it's like slang from England. So if you're from Africa, why are you white? Oh my god, Karen, you can't just ask people why they're white. Why do you wear your hair like that? Your hair looks so sexy pushed back. Katie, will you please tell him his hair looks sexy pushed back? Regina was dangling Aaron in front of me on purpose. I knew how this would be settled in the animal world. <laughs> But this was girl world. Your hair looks sexy pushed back. Hey! Why were you talking to Janice Ian? I don't know. I mean, she's so weird. She just, you know, came up to me and started talking to me about crack. <laughs> she's so pathetic. Let me tell you something about Janice Ian. We were best friends in middle school. I know, right? It's so embarrassing. I don't even... Whatever. So then in eighth grade, I started going out with my first boyfriend, Kyle, who was totally gorgeous, but then he moved to Indiana. And Janice was, like, weirdly jealous of him. Like, if I would blow her off to hang out with Kyle, she'd be like, why didn't you call me back? And I'd be like, why are you so obsessed with me? So then for my birthday party, which was an all-girls pool party, I was like, Janice, I can't invite you because I think you're a lesbian. I mean, I couldn't have a lesbian at my party. There could be girls there in their bathing suits. I mean, right? She was a lesbian. So then her mom called my mom and started yelling at her. It was so retarded. And then she dropped out of school because no one would talk to her. When she came back in the fall for high school, all of her hair was cut off and she was totally weird. And now I guess she's on crack. Regina, we have to talk to you. Is butter a carb? Yes. Gina, you're wearing sweatpants. It's Monday. So? So that's against the rules and you can't sit with us. Whatever. Those rules aren't real. They were real that day I wore a vest. Because that vest was disgusting. You can't sit with us! These sweatpants are all that fits me right now. Fine. You can walk home, bitches. Anything else you want to say? Oh, no, I can't answer any more questions until I have a parent or lawyer present. Miss Smith? Whoever wrote it probably didn't think anyone would ever see it. I hope that nobody else ever does see it. Mom, can, can you pick me up? I'm scared. Janice Ian Dyke. Oh, that's original. You get a function. Hey, that's only okay when I say it. Did you write this? No, I swear. Then you told somebody. She told. You little bitch. You're a bitch. Yeah, take your top off. Now, here's what we're gonna do. Ron, we're gonna... Come quick. They've gone wild. The girls have gone wild. Full tilt jungle madness. And it wasn't going away. Hey, hey, hey. I pulled these two off each other. 
coach car, step away from the underage girls. 